What time of day does your school start for students? Now, does it vary between different key stages? And what does the research say? Now, there's lots of research in secondary schools to say that when we delay the start of the day, it improves student attendance, something to really think about post-pandemic, their behavior, their outcomes, and their general well-being when we think about sleep. But there's not much for primary schools. So this new research, 2022, looks at these areas. It's an open access paper. You've got a graphic here from me, which I'll zoom in in a moment. And then some reflection questions for you to consider when you're reviewing the school academic year for the year ahead, thinking about start times, staggered times, disadvantaged students, those kind of things. Let me just zoom in on this for you to have a little think about. You've got the data here in terms of improving student attendance, the data here in terms of improving or at least reducing school exclusions, a slight increase in math scores, not so much of a difference in terms of reading. Um, so my question to you is, whether you're on key stage two, three or four or even five, how does your school day vary to accommodate your student needs as well as factoring in your families in terms of drop-off times and the general workforce who choose to work in our schools to get the best out of our young people.